Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to show you how to create and launch a stack. To start off, let's log into Marketplace as Marketplace Admin. Once we are logged in, we need to go to VM Image Onboarding. Then go to Resource tab and then click on Add Resource. We need to give the resource name as Nagix App. Resource code will be once again Nagix App without space. Type will be VM. We need to provide the properties as per this file. And we need to update the logo as per the required pixels. Once done, let's click on save. Next, we will proceed with image. Let's click on images in the option here. And then click on add image. Once again, we will update here the image name, image code, platform architecture and type. Please give me some time. Let me update all the details first. We will be only filling in the mandatory fields. Once done, let's click on save. Next, we will proceed with components. Let's click on components and then click on add components on the right side of your screen. We'll once again put in the component name as Nagix plus component, code as Nagix plus, operating system, platforms and toys, image is Nagix plus. We will next go add and save it. Next, we will proceed with resource component and we will click on the option here which says resource component and then click on add resource component. Resource name will be Nagis app, resource type will be operating system and component name will be AWS. And then we will click on save and proceed to next. Next is once again we need to do the same activity. Click on add resource component. And we will select the operating system as Nasix com plus component. We will select the component name as Nasix plus this time and click on save. Th now we will proceed with adding provider image. Click on provider images. Click on add provider images. Service provider will be AWS. Region will be EU US East 1. JC image. From the drop down we need to select Magix A+. Service provider image code, we need to select as AMI-D2BBA1B8 and we need to update the properties and click on save. Next is subscribing to Nagic plus AMI. Once this completes, we need to log into enterprise admin or customer admin as into the store URL. So we are logged into the store as an enterprise admin. Navigate to manage instances and you need to hover the mouse next to the vendor console and select Amazon subscription offer. Click on it. 
this will take you to Amazon portal you need to wait till the portal loads once the portal is completely loaded you need to launch this URL once the URL is loaded you need to click on continue and then you need to accept the software term this completes the step we will proceed to the next step that is creating a three tier stack with Nagex we'll once again go ahead and log into marketplace as marketplace admin here we are into the marketplace admin click on IaaS console and click on create stack template we are into the designer console where we will create our stack the first thing we will go to operating system and drag the operating system to the designer console next is we will go to stack template and we will drag shell script on top of the operating system what you have just dragged we will now go to the script section here we go we are into the script we'll, uh, we'll have to update a script here in this field which we, which will be provided to you here is the script now we will go ahead and create the security group we will provide the permission the first one is TCP we will provide the port range that is from 1 to 65535 and we will provide the IP address as 0, .0, .0, .0. and subnet mass to be 0 we need to provide the name of the security group as well we will provide the name of the instance as magic server instance name to be magic server next is to design mysql server we will drag the linux operating system to the canvas from the operating system which is in the left side of the console and cell script on top of that operating system we will go down to the script and provide the script in the script field once again we will create the security group as per the requirement so next step is to create or design the app server we will drag once again we will drag the Linux operating system to the designer console from the script we will drag the shell script on top of the Linux operating system now we will update the script we have the script here yes we will go we are going to update the script and we will name 
each server as Nagic server, MySQL server, and sample app server and click on launch instance. Once this is done, we can use this option to publish the stack to the respective store. This completes the stack creation. Thank you.